I mean, we dated for a while, so she's important to me. Mm. You know, I don't want I don't want best friends piping her. Mm. He's piping her, isn't he? It, you know. No one wants their roommate to pipe their ex-girlfriend. That's just a fact. A fact that should be considered when choosing where to live and who to live with. Whether it's a dormitory or an off-campus house, what goes down in your domicile determines the trajectory of your life's best four years. And at the University of Tennessee, there's one house in particular called the Blue House that could be on the brink of disaster. What's a code of conduct at this house? What rules do you boys live by? No throwing glass off the balcony. No stupid stuff. Don't break stuff. Especially that breaking chairs. We've had a lot of bad issues with people breaking chairs. A code of conduct can serve as a strong foundation, but the pillars of a college house are the people who call it home. We have uh, Drew. He can turn up, but he can lay it down when we're out of control. Carmichael, the southern boy, uh, he's always wearing his boots. He hates rap music. He hates rap music. Yeah. He can turn up as well. Andre, he can also have a good time. And then leaves Dotson, the man upstairs, or the man in the attic, as we call him. I don't even know where to start with him. Every house has an outsider. And at the Blue House, it's a man named Dotson. We got my room, special little place. Is this the attic? Yeah. Yeah, it's the attic. It's the attic. You live in an attic? Um, yeah. Dodson's roommates have problems with Dodson, and they start from the ground up. Describe his room. He's got a bed, he's got his toilet, shower, sink, all in the same room. His toilet is within three feet of the foot of his bed, probably. How can you trust a guy who shits where he sleeps? I don't know. The men in the blue house do not trust Dodson, not even to shower. What's the worst part about you? Is it the smell? It's definitely not the smell. It's definitely not the smell. If anything, the smells. I think it's a nice smell. A very nice cologne. Actually, it's not my cologne. It's my, it's my roommate's cologne. But, that being said... But, that's what they said you smell like. Some said Dodson's smell even extended beyond the physical sense. It's more of like the presence around him. It's like the air as he walks through, if that makes sense. Does he have a disgusting aura? I don't know. Dodson's smelly smell and disgusting room weren't even the worst parts about him. Even he would admit that. What's the worst thing you've ever done? I'm really close to my best friend's ex-girlfriend. It's, it's pretty, it's pretty intense. He hangs out with my ex-girlfriend all the time. Are you cool with that? No, not at all. And can you see how that would make your roommate mad that you're hanging out with his ex-girlfriend? Yeah, yeah, I can see it. We've talked about it. Yeah. Did it stop you? No. I'm doing it. I know. I told him I'm gonna keep. I'm not gonna just leave her. You know what I mean? Because she's your girlfriend. She's my friend. Just friends? Yeah, just friends. It's always been just friends. It's just friends. <laughs> yeah, it's just friends. The smile seems like I'm lying. I'm not. It's just friends. They told me you're a liar. Okay, that's not true. I thought, you know, if you had a choice between hanging out with me or my ex-girlfriend, you would choose me any day of the week. But he does it. He chooses my ex-girlfriend. So what does she have that you don't? Pussy. You think he's ever seen it? Probably. How does it make you feel? Horrible. It seemed like Dodson was taking Andre's ex-girlfriend to Pipe Town. However, with so much on the line, I was forced to cross-check my references with one more primary source. When you're hanging out with Dottie, what do you do? Watch TV, hang out. Mm -hmm. That's all. That's it? Yeah, that's it. Nothing more? Nope. No, just friends? Just friends. Just friends? Just friends. What do you say to people who say, suspicious? <laughs> Just friends. If Dodson and this young lady truly were just friends, common practice would have them hanging out one to two times per week. So, how much were they hanging out? The thing is, he hangs out with her seven days a week. And he hangs out with me max two. You don't like going out? Be better. Out. 
does. That's she likes not going what it out. Is. She likes going out. I go out at least three days a week. You don't go out for Sunday brunch, that's for sure. Because why would I go out on a Sunday? Sunday is my lazy day. Dude, every day is your lazy day. Between the lifestyle, the smell, and the possible sex addiction, Dawson's sheer existence inside the Blue House was leading to catastrophe. Unless there was some type of intervention. So if you just want to take a seat right here. Do that. They died. Hi, James. What's up, everyone? So I think it's pretty clear that everyone has at least one issue with Dottie. Dottie, they hate you. I want to go one by one and everyone just say one thing that's bothering you about living with this guy. Let's start up here. The fact that you actually enjoy living in a room where your bed is mere feet from your toilet, sink, and shower. I don't know. I feel like I'm the only one to take on the task of living up there. Okay, someone had to do it, so I'll you do chose it. Your you first chose pick. first. I know I did, and I loved it. I'm so happy. You to this bracing. day, I am happy about it. He sucks. Then you still shower in my shower. Well, you know about the vent situation, so. I walked into the, our bathroom like last week, pubes just all over the toilet seat. That was not me. That was 100%. No, it was not. We already, here, we, already, we already debunked this. I have the same razor you do. This was not me. This was, this was not me. you would have me. gone through with it if I did not stop you. You shaved your entire body with my beard razor. That is for my face. That is actually not true. I yes, used Andre's is. razor. But I didn't stop you. <laughs> so did it. you hang on my ex-girlfriend and then you just use my toiletries. I mean, yeah. We're just friends. Just friends? We're just friends. That's what he says. That's what he claims. Is that true? Just friends. Are you guys just friends? Just friends. What's the principle? There's so many girls in this school, and you pick her to spend your time with. It says a guy that fucked everyone in one room. That's true. All right, fine. How about this? Look, I haven't brought her over here. No, yeah, she walked no. in the other day. And I would say I'll be sitting. That room. was different. We were all going out. It was very quick. No, I sit in my room, and then I'll just see her walk yeah, by. I'm like, oh, yeah, great. There she is. I know you said. Thanks, right. Dottie. Things were looking bleak, and I worried that an apology might be impossible. I'm sorry. You're gonna need more than an apology at this point. Yeah. You've Are you gonna stop hanging out with her? No, but like, I am sorry. See, that, this is why he's a shitty roommate. He, he'll apologize, but he won't change. And that's his problem. I never said I was gonna change. That's a very true story. But well, I can say I'm sorry. That's why he's the world's shittiest roommate. You're pushing boundaries right now, my man. He's all, he's all talking to walk. That's clever. I mean, I think this would be appropriate. I think everyone, you should one-on-one -on -one look these guys in the eye and tell them, I will be better, and shake their hand. Is that too much to ask? I'll do it to you, you. No, we're one. We're one house, bro. Yeah. All right, I think you guys should get up and, and come together and... Yeah. Are you gonna work on it? I'll be better. Please do, because I genuinely care about you. I hate to say it, but I still think you are one of my best friends. You hate to say that. Okay, cool, cool, cool. Because cool. of the way you treat me. Right. I'll be better. Thank you. You're That's welcome. all I want to hear. Do you have anything you want to say to him? Honestly, I don't really agree with what you, you told me, but at the same time, just you know for, the, for the, the sense of peace, I'll be better. Thank you, Dots. Gotcha. Thank you. I'll be better. You got a long road, bro. I know. I'll be better, though. All right. It's a marathon, not a sprint. I'll be better.